Well, the water closet is getting another upgrade, so I've got to clear out all of this and a lot of that because our cabinets are here and that is exciting. So cabinets are coming up here all the way down. There's a cabinet shelf here and then we've got a tall guy coming in right here. And then eventually I've got a stainless steel sink prep table area going here and on the other side of the dishwasher. So it's time to get this stuff moved. Cabinets are hung, doors have to be put on, but shelves are in, touch up work needs to happen. I have to purchase a either a piece of stainless steel top or some kind of cabinet top, maybe a piece of granite. But man, what a difference adding built-ins into the water closet. And then now I just need the right size sink and a table thing to go right here for the dishwasher. I will be grateful to get this place organized because it's been a hot mess express. All right, are you ready to see the reveal? They are finished and it is so much better. Like it totally makes the space feel so much bigger. Look at that beautiful cabinet. My husband installed the crown molding up at the top and we now have a little pantry up here and a place for all of our stuff, spices. Such a cool cabinet that I so badly wanted. My microwave fits in here and store other things. Oh my gosh, I'm actually about to uh, make myself some tea here because I haven't had any caffeine today. So we're gonna do that while we're in here. And grab one of my coffee mugs. We're gonna go to my fridge to get some water. And that's about good. And let's set it down so I can open up the microwave. beverage this times two get that water warm okay so now we got storage in here for you know all of this stuff and then I'm loving all of this storage which now because it's kind of high up there I have to have a step ladder that stays in in here at all times because, you know, I'm not that tall. My husband is tall, but I am not that tall. 
So I am just so excited. I know I keep saying that, but this is amazing. And we have the slow to close cabinets, which is super fun. So now all that's left is my sink table that goes right here and then another table that goes right there so that all of this makes sense and hopefully my dishwasher will be fixed one of these days. That would be great. Oh, oh that's hot. That was hot. Wowzer, that's hot. For some reason, the handles on my coffee mugs get stupid hot on that setting. So now we're gonna let my tea bag steep so that I can enjoy a cup of tea. And yeah. This coming week, we are heading up to Wisconsin for the plane show. And so we will be traveling and I have, and I have never been to Chicago. We're flying into Chicago. We're not staying in Chicago, but flying into Chicago and I've never been to Wisconsin. And that's where we will be for the next few days that later this week. And then we are going to pop over to Vegas. So there is going to be some really cool adventure. Coming up on the House of Sugar Creek, Plains, Vegas, you know, it's the downtime during wedding season right now because it's just stupid hot in Texas and my dashboard readout temperature said 126 degrees today and that's just stupid. So I'm going to be enjoying leaving Texas for a bit to go adventuring and uh, yeah, I can't wait to take you along. So if you missed last week's episode, I'm queuing it up right here. If you haven't subscribed to the House of Sugar Creek, click my profile picture right here and get to subscribing so that you don't miss out on a new episode of the House of Sugar Creek, which happens every single week. So hit play, hit subscribe, and I will be back soon.